Now, as much as I, there's many things I don't like about FedEx, DHL, and UPS, namely their outrageous broker fees that they charge on everything they deliver. One thing can be said about their drivers is that um, they follow instructions. So let's watch the FedEx truck pull up here and he's going to deliver a package. He's going to see the sign on my door and he's going to deliver the package around back where it's not going to get damaged. So let's bring up camera three, which is the front door camera. The driver gets out of his truck, he's going to rock around, pick up the package, which is a new product that's going to be reviewed shortly. And he walks up to the door. He's not even going to get to the door. He's going to see the sign. He's not even going to ring the doorbell. He's walking up to the door now. He looks up. Oh, around back. Okay, let's time him. Canada Post really needs to take a page out of what the competition's doing because, um, you know, leaving an expensive package out front for all to see and steal is just not the way to generate business. And when pe people get uh, their products stolen, they get kind of pissed off. Here's the time. It takes them about 20 seconds to get around the back. So, like, we're not talking a long time to deliver this package. This fellow actually went the extra distance right to the back door, but there is a door on the side of my garage, which is only about uh, 10 seconds from the front door, which is out of view, which is all I really ask is just to, to put it around the side so it can't be seen from the front. But the FedEx driver and the UPS driver and the DHL driver, they go the extra mile and take it right around to the back. Uh, there have been a couple of postal carriers that also take stuff around to the back. Some of them do, and that's great. And then you get the odd one, like I had to deal with the other day, who left a big box that said Sony all over it, right at my front door. I think maybe it's time that Canada Post changed their policy to help prevent loss. And that's all we're asking for. Is let's try to prevent the loss.